If y'all want to see how I create this, stay tuned. Like, comment, and share, and please subscribe. It really helps. Okay, I thought I would show you what I'm going to be putting on my vegan pizza. It's a veggie pizza. So I have the pizza crust here I got from Trader Joe's. Mozzarella, uh, vegan mozzarella shredded cheese. Um, I read this has no soy in it. So, or that I read, unless I, yeah, it has no soy. Okay. I'm going to cut up some green pepper, red pepper. I have green onions, white onion, black sliced olives, and here's the marinara sauce. So, yeah. Let's get into it. Hey guys, I'm back. So, the marinara sauce. And I'm kind of using a spoon, a big soup spoon. Um, uh, it says, just says home style. So essentially, I got like a flat bread at Trader Joe's. Um, or it'll kind of be like a fire. I'm trying not to put too much close to the edge. Because when you put it in the oven, what'll happen is... It'll burn. It'll go down in the, the stove. So, got my butter on there. Um, I'm going to add, this is just me and what I like to do, some turmeric for seasoning. Turmeric is really good for you, by the way. A little cayenne pepper, because I want it kind of spicy. And I want it to be in the, you know, you're going to taste it in the crust and the sauce. So, of course, the cheese is not vegan cheese. I'm probably going to just put about a fourth of a cup of vegan cheese on top. I haven't used this brand before, so hopefully this stuff melts. It smells decent. It smells decent. Usually, if a vegan cheese is good, it, it smells good. So, you can actually smell... The salty whatnot now I'm just doing veggies I'm trying to stay away from eating too much meat alternative but when the kids get in here if they want to do um, some type of meat on the pizza they can hold on wait scratch that I lied I have some leftover taco combo in here. I'm going to throw on the pizza. Don't judge me, y'all. I'd rather cook it than to waste it. So. It's got like corn and beyond meat. I'm sure it'll be good. I'm gonna add a, a little bit more flavor. Okay, so on to the veggies. I know you're like, what is she doing, y'all? But this is just what I like. Um, so I have some white onion. And I try to get loaded on the veggies because sometimes you don't get enough in. Some green onion. I mean, green. This is bell pepper. I'm sorry, y'all. And red bell pepper. And of course, I did not preheat my oven. I don't know what I was thinking about, but I'm going to preheat my oven. Now, at three said I chopped all of this, but sometimes my knives need to be sharpened because it didn't sharpen all that good. Then I'm gonna take some black olives and put those, just kind of place them all on the pizza. Like so. So everybody looks like it's having a little party with each other. 
Then I'm gonna top it off with some basil. So I'm gonna pack this bad boy in the oven and I'll be back to taste test and let you guys know how it turned out. I'm getting ready to dive into this pizza. Oh my gosh, it is so pretty. I'm so proud of myself, guys. I didn't make the crust from scratch, <clears throat> but everything else is. So we have some Beyond Meat taco meat, some corn, uh, black olives, onions, <clears throat> red bell pepper, green bell pepper. I decided not to put the green onion on there. Vegan cheese and some store-bought marinara, and I sprinkled some little basil on top as well. So, yes, I'm getting ready to get into it. Mmm. Mmm, 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 God. <clears throat> 